Take two, audioing. This is James Gamer 1050 recording. Separate this place seven days. And I am really pissed off right now. Really. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. <laughs> well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. All right, take two, audioing for Audacity, not in a good mood right now because it took me 22 minutes to finish this all, and I had to take another 22 minutes to finish this again. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay, if we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before I drawing this. any conclusions. I really hate I this. can't wait until everyone's out here, everyone besides Larry. What's up with you telling him what I said about him? But I'll do it anyway. Look, you said it. You even admitted I'll do it right it again to him. Anyway. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. So, this is a temp. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. The reason this is take two, because when I test it out, as soon as it's good, it turned out to be a fuddler sound. Looks like he's stuck. A static sound for my audacity. So I had to take another 22 minutes again. And, and if this doesn't work again, then the next time this happens again, you're going to have video without a commentary. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Okay. Once this fence take is patched two. up... This place Attempt will be a two. fortress. And if this doesn't work, Can you imagine then not forget having to worry it. No about commentary. The anymore? And if this works, you got lucky. You're having commentary. It's dangerous. I'm not in a good mood. True, but it's also dangerous to the walkers. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. <laughs> We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. There's another one. I see it. Anyway, I noticed um, there weren't any people making these videos since 2012, December, since Super Game Guy 11 made an announcement video. So, today, 2014, I will be the first one for 2014. You never get used to the smell, do you? For y'all. <laughs> nope. Sorry about what happened, random blast voice. Christ. I'll come back to your channel. Can't stop thinking about dinner. For the first time since June. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. I really hope this works. I really do. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're going to be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Sorry if I'm talking to the talking. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there. Sorry, I'm talking good. through the. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy Mr. off again. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm talking through the cussing. It's just I'm not. I'm not in a good mood. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. A little help here, Lee. I'm not in a good mood, so that's why I've been talking. Now. I think I know why it happened. I turned off my headphones and then I turned it back on and my screwed everything up. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. <laughs> what the? Get to the gate! Get down! You asshole! Jesus! 
bandits. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Peak cut. We don't mean you any harm, goddammit! Alright, so we gotta go to the right. Oh, by the way, this is post-commentary. That's why I've been saying to take two. I gotta come back. So I was running out of time before I die. <clears throat> the blades are stuck in the dirt. <laughs> Not good at aiming. We gotta go to the left, but I don't. I had to find. I had to figure. I had to find this um, block that I realized it was at the wheel. And there's this flaw right here. Or something else. The heck? Is he a ghost, or did he use magic tricks to come strictly back up and look at the bandits? That's weird. I look back up, it's chicken out line, and I figure out there was a wheel. Get out of here and me like a man! No fuel! Of course. And, wow, my bad. And there's this block. Damn, what about our arrangements? If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit, that hurts. You assholes! I already got one of you! Okay. Uh, these guys are really, really addicted to food in the apocalypse. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move it. So we have to pull this walker. I actually died in this part. <laughs> it was actually pretty funny. Cause I didn't know it was it was gonna be not that. You okay? Yeah. Fair. And this part right here is a gate like that. You don't move. Choice: too fast or too slow. Either way, you're dead. Get out of here. You lucky sons of bitches. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. No. We ain't going nowhere. And back to the camp. St. John's. We St. John's University of Real Life. Ooh, represent New York City, Staten Island College. Lee, what's wrong? There's a goddamn ambush out there! Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all! Mark! Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. So much for, so your, much deal. for your deal. Shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, we would have gone out there with you. 
Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Frozen moment. They hate that. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my tree house. Come swing. on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Swing. All right, let's head back to the house and talk to Dan. So we can get out of here and do this. There he is. Fellas, how you feeling, mate? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell Those yeah. Ten minutes. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think ten some of them used to work at the big back. box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Clementine. This is big boy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> And this is the part where, this is the part where I turn off my headphones. This time I'm not here. gonna do it. It's gotta be close. Ah, <sighs> boy. Here. Oh shit! You found it. Sneak up on the camp, trying to find some food, and possibly trying to find Clementine's hat, bro. You see anybody? Can't tell. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. I sound quiet too, Dan. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Alright, sure, let's find something while we're going back. No, 
That doesn't make any no. sense. Let's find some food. Take food. And... Hit bed St. John's. Empty. Alright. I guess we can't look at the tent yet. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lot by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. All right. It looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid-sized. It looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of I did it twice by accident. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. They did cross the line. Oh, it's the thing I used. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. You know, I used to use the video camera. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. You know, I used to use video camera for seven let's play seven days. Now I don't because I got the PVR. Oh yeah. So now I can use the HD PVR, even though this is not freaking HD, it's just I'm using a movie maker. I can use screen recording at least. Hey, at least 40, 480 won't kill me. Oh, man. I don't need 720, I could just use 480, 360, and 240. I don't need 720 or 1080. I don't care, I just want to upload videos. It's Clementine's hat. Uh oh. The hell? Don't be fucking me. It's Daryl's wife. <laughs> Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. If you tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, soft arrow right through your eyeball into your goddamn brain you're not men you're monsters all men are monsters take what they want and then destroy it all take a can of beans take a little girl it's all the fucking same to you screw this y'all wave them guns like you're looking well, to die okay. shit yes. what the hell did you do that for we had a deal with them She was about to shoot us both. You could have just taken her down. You didn't have to kill her. I mean, I know she was crazy, but damn. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. Going back? 
If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Good boy. And Dan is now Daryl Dixon. <laughs> Is now 20 minutes. It will be missed. <laughs> uh, 6:47 p.m. It's gonna turn to 6:50 when it, when the video is over. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. You're back. What happened? Lee took care of it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. <laughs> princess. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. All right. Attempt number two clear. When well, be my last in the first attempt, the video, the audio screwed up when I finished it. It was clear when I was doing it, but when I ended, it's messed up. And that will do it for this Friday. So next Friday, we'll go to the barn and give Clementine a hat. JC Gamer 1050 personal channel saying, see y'all next week on the first one.